Hello everybody, welcome to the very first episode of What's the Plus. Uh, this month is December, and the first game we have on the list is <coughs> Kung Fu Panda Showdown of Legendary Legends. Uh, uh, this was free this month. Um, I've got no idea what the fuck this is. Uh, options! Up to jump. No, that's okay. The graphics, uh, don't look that great. Master Shifu, otherwise known as Dennis Hoffman. Even though he's been, he has been elevated to Uguay's position as spiritual leader of the Valley of Peace, Shifu is still a few steps shy of enlightenment. Although he tries his best, Master Shifu occasionally struggles under the pressure and responsibilities of stepping into such big shoes. Sometimes... All right. Most times, Poe's antics still send his old master searching for calm and a cup of hot tea and a meditative chant of inner peace, inner peace. Though small, Shifu is a powerhouse in combat by honing his focus and precision. He's able to exert maximum force with minimal effort. His greatest asset is his ability to read his opponents and know what they intend to do. This allows his lightning fast strikes to target the nerve points of his opponents with great precision. Shifu's uh, elusiveness borders on the mystical. He's capable of appearing where he's least expected in the blink of an eye. Oh, Tigress, Angelina Jolie, Jackie Chan, uh, David Cross, Jack Black. I don't remember. I apologize, Master Way. Mr. Ping. Oh, uh, James Hong. Po! You forgot your noodle! Su Wu. Tai Lung. Oh, that was, a uh, uh, was Ian McShane. Love him. Oh, baby, Po! Rhino Commander Vachir, Va Vachir. Uh, that was Michael Clark Duncan, may he rest in peace. Master Croc, John claude Van Damme, motherfuckers! If you think I'm joking, I'm not. Master Boar, uh, I forget. Master Storming Ox, Soothsayer, Wolf Boss, Gorilla Soldier, Shen. Um, <coughs> I don't remember actually, I don't know who did Shen. May May, that was, uh, she was in uh, Bride's Wars. The Blonde. Master Bear. There's a lot of characters in this. Uh, wait. Is Mantis... Hold on. Is Mantis not a... Motherfucker. Seth Rogen! Uh, Tournament of Legends, I guess. Uh, let's go regular with Poe. Difficulty. Uh, wait. Wait. What? Which one's which? What? I'm guessing that's hard. Uh, easy. Brawler. Uh, let's go with instructor, I guess. I don't fucking know. Uh, okay. So, no practice. We're just getting right into it. Uh, and let's see what's the plus of downloading this game. Is this something you should have in your library? Is this something that'd be... Hundreds of years oh. ago, there was unrest in the Valley of Peace. Heroes and villains were locked in a constant struggle to prove who was the most skilled. All seemed hopeless until one day a kung fu student, wise beyond his That's a good Jack Black impression, forward, but it's not. And demanded that a tournament be held to determine once and for all po. who was the most bodaciously awesome kung fu master in all the land. Po. Yeah, Po was pretty awesome, but Po. Oh, hey, Master Shifu. Po. Huh. The unrest was not hundreds of years ago. It was last week. All last week. Yeah, but... And the constant struggle was you nagging me to hold this so-called showdown of legendary legends. The but, voices in yeah, this are actually really I good. Said, yes. Yeah, but... Really? Cool! <sighs> Everyone is already assembled. Let's just get on with it, shall I've we? I've been a big fan of Jack Black for a long time. Uh... My fist Elimination! Yes. The croc is ready to rock. Uh. <laughs> oh shit. Ah. Oh. Oh, damn. Okay, so there's an uppercut. Uh. Oh, that's uh. Oh, okay. So. Yeah, son of a bitch. Ah! Oh! Oh! So, 
combos are pretty simple, actually. There's my butt. Ow! Mantis! No! Don't betray me! Okay. Damn, what the? What the fuck, dude? Ow. Oh, shit! Well, there's a dash. Okay. Um. There's a grab. Aha! Wait, how do I grab? Damn it! Bah! Elimination! Yeah! this? So this isn't a... Wait. No, no, no. Ah, no! This is very, uh... Ah, ha, ha! No! How the fuck do you pick things up? Okay, uh... Not circle. Not that. Not that. L2? Nope. Right, nope. Oh! Ah! Oh shit. Okay. Oh! Ah! Did I win? Yes! Okay. So this uh controls like a shitty. <laughs> A shitty uh, Smash Brothers. Um, I don't know how to pick things up. Uh, Let's do this already. I'm hungry, and the kitchen closes in about an hour. Are you ready for this? I do not think so. <laughs> you can't defeat me. Bear in mind that I am a kung fu master. Huh, <laughs> You cannot do combos and shit, man, like, at all. Ah! Ah! I will. How do I. No! I'm okay. Ah! No, I'm not. Yes, I am. Ah! Son of a bitch! What the fuck? Okay. God damn, it's like super accurate just to, uh. What are these things? Mm. Okay, so you can just like straight up pretty much fucking do that anywhere. So I'm like, ah! What the fuck is am I doing? The controls are so delayed and slow. God damn. And it just like son of a bitch. It's honestly just like press the same buttons over and over. Even the way you come down the screen is the same. Nah, I'll just chill here until I until it's safe. Yeah, this, this works. In fact, this works quite nicely. Ow. I'm not doing so well. Ah! Ah! Well, I'm dead. Oh, I see that little. Uh, well, he just killed himself. Come on, Master Croc. You, you can do it, Master Croc. You can do it. Come on. Don't let me down, Master Croc. You can do it. Oh, uh, you, you, okay, you, you let me down. No, we died. Uh, let me try one more fight. Cause this, this thing does not. Am I playing it wrong or is it just bad? Cause it <laughs> it does not feel good. Um, My fist hungers for justice. Okay, yes, yes. Uh, well, hold on. Options, controls. Uh, flash dodge, grab, throw item. Uh, throw item or taunt. Move, block, block, jump. Awesome attack. Okay, the circle is awesome attack. Rock is ready to rock. <laughs> well, there's no way to skip you this. You can't defeat me. You will bear the front of my kung fu skills. Did somebody just like make this on a weekend? Ah! 
It's not doing anything! That, that's a fucking lie! You guys just... Ah, son of a bitch! Not again! Ah! Why the fuck... Okay. Ah! Give it that it's not, not, not good. Oh, I see. Am I like supposed to like build up my shit quite a lot and then? Ah, shit. Okay, so that little blue bar down at the bottom, I'm supposed to build it up and then I can use a special attack. I'm guessing. Okay. Uh, awesome attack. I grabbed his dick. I straight up grabbed his dick. Like, I'm not even kidding. That was a dick grab. Uh, I, I will. God damn, why is this so slow? That was easy. I grabbed his dick. Is there? Is there a? Is there a replay? All right, let me let me do this one last fight. Um. God damn. Uh, <laughs> not good, guys. Not. Let's do this already. I'm hungry. And the kitchen oh yes, in I get it. Hour. Skip. You don't want a monkey with me. They're not funny. Kind of getting the hang of it, but I, I'm not liking it at all. Uh, oh, that's how you do it. Ah, damn it! This is it's. Break the bridge. Give me that. Give me that. Oh, that's how you do it. Okay. Where'd he go? I'm gonna beat him with the whooshy finger hold. Uh, that that's that guys. That's I'm done. I'm done with this. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, this is a cheap uh, Smash Brothers ripoff. Um, like literally, right even here. the I analog stick is is a quick started. smash. If you hold it, you'll charge it up. Um, there there's like no combos. There's just a simple um, like fucking. Oh, are you fucking? Okay, now I'm pissed because this is just this is just regular coin match like from uh, Smash Brothers. This is this is the coin match right here. I'm not even kidding. This is straight up coin match. Like like straight up coin match. But it's food. You you're not clever. This has been done before. Son of a bitch. Uh, but yeah, it's it's just a, it's just a cheap rip off of. Uh, Smash Brothers. It's it's not not even a good one. Not even a good uh, ripoff. It's uh, it's really not much to say about it. It's just it's Smash Brothers, but just not a good one. 
Like, you can literally win just by clicking the same button. See, look, I'm I'm barely even trying. And I'm, I'm still winning. Ow. The awesome button is ready! But, uh, yeah, that's... Guys, that is, uh... Uh, what, what the fuck is this game called? Uh... Uh, Kung Fu Panda, the Legend of Legendary Legendness or something. Uh, this on the uh, What's the Plus level would have to be a negative. Uh, you can you can easily just avoid this one. Um, don't even bother. Uh, <laughs> oh, you know, let's see what the downloadable content is. <laughs> um, yeah, no, it's... Uh, it's uh, I don't even want to say mediocre. It's just, it's not fun to play <laughs> um the voice acting was pretty good for that one one scene which i actually like um that wasn't i i don't it, i don't think it's the real ones but i mean it was pretty uh it was pretty spot on so let me see real quick uh kung fu panda not land uh legendary legend legend or something and yeah, that's not even. So yeah, there's no, there's no, um, there's no DLC. <laughs> um, <laughs> but yeah, out of a, out of a uh, positive or a negative, this one gets a negative. I'm sorry to say, Kung Fu Panda, your movies are fun, but uh, oh great, now it's frozen. Oh god. Uh, <laughs> um, well, that's that. Uh, let's see what we got next on the docket. Okay, so this one here, uh, it's a mixed bag. Um, this one here is called Forma 8. Uh, I've got no idea what this is. Language, English, vibration on. Wow, that's a lot of uh, settings. Let's see. Uh, <coughs> wow, four new games instead of the regular three. Four is, ooh, just bold. Um... <coughs> Oh shit, it's the USG Ishimura. Nice. I'm liking the visuals. It's uh, quite interesting. It reminds me of uh, Powerpuff Girls back in the day. Hmm. I am, I am liking the shading. It's really simple. It's really cool. <coughs> <laughs> so let's see what this uh, what this one consists of. While uh, while it's happening, I'm going to grab a cough drop. Oh no! I crashed into a building. A building. Um, it's made with a Unity engine, and uh, I'm I'm not going to lie. I feel like Unity is very overhyped. This is Mario made on Unity. This is Legend of Zelda, made on Unity. It's like, that's, that's, that's great, man. I mean, I, sure, it looks... Ooh. Ooh. That's interesting. I mean, sure, it looks great, but it's overhyped. I'm, I'm sorry to say, but... Ooh, that lighting is nice. Okay. So, let's, uh... Ooh. Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I'm just gonna click buttons. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Whee. It's dark down here. Whoa. Okay. What's that? Can I grab it? Nope. Uh, so so far no real like noise. Ooh. Well, that's deadly. Go! Okay, well, there's some sound effects now. That's delayed, but good. Um, ooh, what's that? 
That's a cute little guy. It's another one of me. Um, X. X, X. Ooh. Oh, health. Very nice. I like the little jingle. But that's a dead one. One died. Be ah! Ooh. Ah! Okay, well, that's, uh. Let's go. So, let's, uh. Huh. So far, this is. It's intriguing. I'll give it that. Um. Obviously, a, it, it's kind of a. In lieu of limbo and inside. Um. Which, which is. No, there's nothing wrong with that. That's actually really good. Uh, there's obviously a key up there, so I'll go get the key. By I, I guess I gotta blow these rocks away, or can I not do that yet? Nope, I can totally do that. Health. Key. Oh, that's actually really nice. I like that jingle. This is kind of cool. Nope. But uh, okay, remember that there's something there. Uh, I'll probably get like a boost or something later. Uh, there's the map. Interesting. I'm um, charge it up. Yeah. Whoa. Is this a save? Um. Uh, no. Can I do something with it? Or nope. Nothing. All right. Yeah, like a boss. It's a uh, oh, very pretty. Hi. Oh, it's a. Uh... Ow, you bastard! Murder you. Um. I'm. I like the art. It's very ah. I feel they were evil birds. It's very cute. Um. You just have like. Free reign to just explore wherever. Um, uh, relaxing is, is what I would say about this game. It's it's quite relaxing. Um, what's this thing though? Uh, another lead. Okay, I guess. So I'm guessing yeah, you're gonna get like upgrades and whatnot. Um, apologize, apo apologies for all the ums. I'm just finding it kind of hard to talk about this one. It's it's sweet. It's simple. It's a game. It's a video game. Uh, the artwork I really like, actually. It's very, very relaxing. It's, it's really well done, too. The shading and everything. Can I go in the... I can go in the water. And, uh... A little bit darker. That's cool. Pushing the water up. It reminds me of Loco Roco or Poco Poco Lo Loco Loco Poco. That game where you play the about the the rhythm. You play the little bouncy ball. Or not really rhythm, but more like you just rotate the screen. Uh. We'll play this for a bit longer. Uh, see if we can get another upgrade. But the visuals are nice. The music is nice. Uh, there's my upgrade. Whoa. This ain't... Okay, this ain't me. This is... Oh, it is me. Okay, never mind. Um, this is new. I'm a little fireball. I'm a little fireball. Watch me burn. Uh. Oh, damn, son. Okay. Um, maybe if I didn't slow down earlier, I would have made it. Okay, hold on. Let me, uh, position myself perfectly. There we go. Let's go. Hm. Quick. Gotta get it 
quick. Gotta get it quick. Yeah, back down. All right, come on, you're almost there. Almost there, dude. Uh, no, no, no. There's just two more. One more. Ah, uh, okay. What did I get? What did I get? Uh, okay. That is not the droid I'm looking for, but I will take it. So, Forma 8. Forma 8. Forma 8. I don't know. Forma 8. Does it mean anything? There's like old ruins there of like, it looks like serpents breathing fire, otherwise known as dragons. Um, the little trail behind him is kind of cute. Some, uh, big open map. Very big open map. Uh, the one thing that they really need to, uh, hopefully they have later is, uh, a speed boost. I, I do like the fact that there are enemies. It's not just, you know, like, avoid danger. It's like, no, you can actually fight back. What is that? That looks, uh, important. And instead of fighting, it's like if they get close, just, you know, repel them. You know, before I go down there, let me uh, see whatever that was. Oh, that was cool. I went through the grass and I made a little... Wow. Actually, really nicely done. Uh, what? I'm getting all these trophies, but I don't know what the fuck they mean. Like, honestly, I've got no clue. Now, you just got one that said addicted to life. Now, uh, let's uh, continue, I guess. <laughs> Again, the, the artwork. Oh, oh, shit, son! Not expecting that at all. No. Nah. What the fuck is it, man? Okay, uh, I guess I can't kill it. Okay, leave. Leave. Run! Run! Okay. They can't get through. They can't get through. No, they can get through! <laughs> Run! What is it? What is it? Uh, square. Hmm? Oh, shit, son. So, okay, now I got a bomb. So that's a pretty cool upgrade. Let's let's play for just a, a little bit more. See if uh see if there's anything anything else worth noting. Um here you can have this. Boom. Very sweet. Come here, you little bastards. That's how you beat that. Okay. And then, of course, there's this, which, yeah, that's not going to push it away. So, how about a bomb? Yeah. All right. So, it's got a whole very, very tiny Metroidvania style. Oh, oh it's a spider! doesn't work um what am I supposed to do here he's got like this whole bubble just around him can I hide can I hide in the dirt in the grass I mean damn it nope okay well he notices me so Maybe, like, there's a rock that I can destroy to, like, flood that area, or... Let's see, shall we? 
Here's a rock. Nope. Um. All right. So there's nothing I can do there. Let me just draw all these guys. That does nothing. Oops. Uh, so there's a giant freaky little spider, or oh, big spider, that I can't get close to right now. So let's uh, let's head back to the first place in the map. Um, cause I can't go, I can't go right, I can't go down. That motherfucker's just blocking me. So let's just head up back to the top. I uh, yeah, I thought so. Okay. Um. Boom. Huh. <sighs> Let's head all the way back up. And. Just kind of see. See what that other place is. Again, very sweet game. Very nice music. Visuals are very, uh, cute. Um. Not futuristic in any way. It's, uh... It's very... Out of this world kind of feeling. It really it really does kind of feel like uh, out of this world. Bomb. Nothing. I guess that's like a checkpoint or something? Uh, see, I'm trying to get down there, but uh, I couldn't get close enough to use the bomb. Yeah, nothing. That doesn't do anything. Can use them at the same time. Doesn't do nothing. Ooh. 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 Oh, okay. It's not hurt that bad, actually. Uh, oh, there we go. Uh, uh, so, so far, already more entertaining than uh, uh, Kung Fu Panda, at least. Which is, uh, which is good. Um, let's see, shall we? What is up here? If I, if I can't find out what the fuck to do, I will just uh, stop. I, I'll, I'll go see that... Uh, that spider one more time. See if I'm missing something. Uh, hold on. Nope. No. I guess that's just where I came in from, huh? Alright. So, uh, sorry. It's gonna take me a second. Uh, this was fucking pointless. Uh, looks like the button for that door is on the other side. Um... I'll see if I can, uh, if I can get through that spider. Uh, hopefully I can. Because if not, it's, uh, that means at the beginning of the game and I'm already fucking stumped. Um. I don't know. Let's see. Because they want me to go down there. Which, um, that spider guy was blocking. Maybe there's a door to the right that I missed. I don't know. But so far, uh, this one has been very positive. Um, so far, I mean, absolutely no story from what I've seen. Uh, <coughs> I don't know what the fuck that is still. Maybe it's a checkpoint or something. I don't know. Purple I can go through. Black I can't. Um... Sit down. Be humble. I'll head down to this guy and uh, see if I can't do anything about the spider. Something I might be missing. Um, sorry about the um. Uh, okay, so while it is very entertaining, it's um, it's um, very um. This is one of those games where you just kind of play and. 
every few seconds you go, um, because there's really not much to say. Huh. Oh. Oh, shit! Okay, that's what you do. Uh, I figured it out. That's, that's, okay, that, that, that kind of increased my, my liking of this. That was interesting, actually. I don't know if you saw that, and uh, if not, I will show you again here in a second. But I know... Huh. Um... Oh, God, I'm sorry. I, I know exactly what I'm supposed to do here. Okay. <laughs> and then just... Whoop. Uh. Take this, you dumb bitch. So that's what that is. It's a little shot that I can do. So, so like, uh, you sit down. Do they over there? Just shoot it directly at him. That is, that is nice. That is a good, a uh, good, uh, little detail, I guess. Very, very, very well thought out. <coughs> uh, I guess I push this myself. Or do I shoot it? Do I gotta shoot my little grenade inside? Nope. I, I will get to the bottom of this room and we'll call it there. But yeah, no, very positive. Very positive. This is uh seems like something that'd be really good to have in your collection. Uh it'd be really good to try out, to play, just to experience it. Um I like it. It's I feel like this wouldn't be such a long game. Probably something you can actually just beat in about a day or two. But, you know, regardless of that, I think, I think it's, I think it's a very good one that Plus has released this month. Uh, I, I kind of wish that they would have done something a bit Christmassy, um, but they have not. Oh shit, that's lava. Ah! And I'm fucked. <laughs> well, that's <laughs> that's four my eight. Uh, interesting. Okay, let's see what we got next. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Uh, actually, I, I just realized I don't need to say what's up. This is already like halfway through the video. Um. But, uh, this is Red Dead Revolver. I fucking wish. Um, this is pretty much the big game for, uh, free this month. Darksiders 2, Definitive Edition. Uh, I've played the first one, have not played the second one at all. Um, I know that some of these games get pretty popular. Uh, okay, I can I couldn't really do anything there. Uh, I know this is pretty popular. I heard they're making a third one. Um, let's see how this one is, how different it is from the first one, because I I know there can be no life without order, good, evil, darkness, light. There must be balance in the universe. Such is the decree of the Charred Council, an ancient body charged by the I'm Creator these guys. to preserve the very fabric of existence. But the balance Who has been disturbed my slumber. Earth smolders in ruin, fallen to the demon lords, and the Destroyer carves a new kingdom amongst his mighty chosen. Even though I haven't finished the first one, I believe this is like a prequel. Triggered the apocalypse uh. that he rode to Earth, unbidden. 
endured all of mankind. But what of the other horsemen? Fearless enforcers of the Council's will. What a fury, strife, and death. To know those names, you must first know another. Okay. Nephilim, cursed union of angel and demon. So, Dante. Dante's the one behind the apocalypse. And burned them to ash. But four amongst them grew weary of the slaughter and feared their conquest would imperil the balance. And so a truce was made. The four would serve the council in exchange for unimaginable power. If they just made a game Thus where instead of controlling one of the uh, first task looks like Strife has two guns, which is pretty cool and pretty cool. To annihilate the Wait, Strife, shouldn't it be a... Uh, no, it should be death, famine, pestilence, and war. Not fury and strife. To one amongst the four. Not war, who lies chained at the council's feet, professing his innocence. But one who would save his brother above all else. He has many names. Kinslayer, he looks pretty cool. Executioner. Death. Yeah, he kind of looks like uh, Joey Jordison from Slipknot. But why don't they just make... Instead of like, hey, in this game you play as Fury, and this one you play as Strife. Why not just have like a, hey, here is a classic action game with RPG elements uh, that you can play up to four people. You know? So I'm here to bring everybody back. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I believe this one is a prequel. I, I did play the first one quite a lot, but there's always something about it that just never intrigued me so much. But... I, I already am uh, thinking that this game is going to be a positive. I mean, even if it's not the best, it's still free. I mean, the only difference between the Kung Fu Panda one is... That game was shit. Maybe I should have played another character, though, but I'd rather not. Ah, look at you, Joey! The one band member who always looked better with his mask. I'm kidding. Partially. His mask. It's just his mask was so badass. Alright. So here we get started. Uh, his nipples must be like super cold right now. Uh, that glows whenever despair is available for use. Uh, L1 and R1 to summon or banish despair. Okay, so there's a jump. Uh, there's, there's my, my attack. Uh, charge. Okay, so it saps stamina. Oh, cool. Uh, yeah, there's really, really not much I can do. I guess I'll just ride up in here. Whoa. Whoa! Hey, little guy, you just disappeared. All right. He, this, this. Even though the graphics are nice, this feels like, and I'm not even gonna say PS3. This feels like a PS2 game. Like, I mean, it, uh, it doesn't feel like it looks like it could have been a PS2 game. Like the character design. Uh. Okay. Ha ha ha. Like, there's really nothing about this that really sticks out as a, uh, a PS3 or PS4 game. I mean, even the graphics are just, they're okay. And they're not, uh, they're not anything. Okay, uh, that's, that's interesting. Did I just pick up armor? Okay, I'm liking that. That's nice. You get armor that you can actually equip. Um, so it's it's got more of an RPG element than the first one. It looks like. Uh, um, quest. Wow, this that's actually a really cool map. I guess that's pretty fucking sweet. I like that. Four minutes. All right, I'm in four minutes. Uh, general. Okay. Uh, 
uh, time, Re Reaper, oh, okay. Uh, square and X, or X during most of the, I'm guessing that's, uh, what, like a rising thunder? Return slash, razor slash, let me see. Uh, let's try side saw. After any, okay. Sky slash, melee, huh, heavy. Triangle doesn't do shit. Yep. Yep. Uh, R1 just doesn't roll. I've got no gun or anything. Is that a bird? Why is he glowy? Wait. Why is he on my map? Hey, come here. What? What do you want? Are you my crow? Oh, the crows can't tell me like... I can't do a never more find a way to save war move towards a wall and, and, and press jump okay we that's kind of cool I guess yeah bitch so I I I am digging the uh, where is it? Oh, interesting. I am digging the RPG aspect of it. It's, it is nice, actually. Whoa. Uh, can I? Yay! I got potions. I'm I'm digging it so far. Um, I think I paid for this game once uh, for the PC. I think I only paid like it, it, it literally had just come out the definitive edition. Um, I believe. Oh, okay, that's actually not too bad. I believe that. Uh, ooh, I'll equip it. Yay! I'm looking more like. Uh, more like a badass now. Come here. Wait, what's that? Circle? Uh, I'll just pick it up. Maybe I can sell it. Death can traverse wooden beams in the environment. That does not really look like a wooden beam. That just looks like a giant stalactite. Wee. And then, oh, wee. Yay! Who the hell were you? But yeah, uh, the, I believe the game had just come out actually, and uh, I, I bought it for I think like four dollars. Not even kidding. Uh, I've still never played it. It's just, it's on the PC. I am liking that. That's uh, that does feel pretty good. Yeah, ha ha. I always like the aerial combos, if you can tell. Ooh, damn. That was quite nice. So the combat does feel good, uh, you know. It's it's your it's your typical uh, God of War style beat 'em up, uh, likable character, I guess. I mean, it's death. Everybody likes every, everybody likes death. <laughs> yeah, you like that wall? Anything that way? No. Oh, is that a is that a wooden beam? It is a wooden beam. That is, I mean, the the platforming is interesting. Uh, it's it's it feels nice enough, I guess. Um, come on out, boy. Yeah. Ah, 
Impossible. Wow, Death, you're really, uh... Yeah, sure. Oops. I'll just pick it up. Did I equip that one already? Oops. Uh, oops. Goddamn. There's a lot of things to do. So what's the difference between these two? Hmm... I do like the fact that death looks really uh skinny. You know, you don't you don't really want you want war to be the big beefy guy. You want death to be the uh the thinner thinner like guy. Um but his coloring if you give him just like a bit of like a, a cuter face, he would fit perfectly into a Tim Burton film. I'm not even kidding. Uh, wall vines. Who the fuck is talking, man? Mark Hamill was in the, uh, the first one. And he was great. He, he, I mean, he's always great. You know, it's Mark Hamill. What do you expect? He's basically just kind of doing his Joker voice. Um... But no, yeah, platforming feels fun. Combat feels good. I like the whole weapon system. Uh, the armor thing. That's all cool. Alright, Ice Golem. So far, nothing's really blown me away. I can see that this is, this is entertaining, and I'm actually probably going to play a lot more of this game. Ow. Uh, oh, cool. Oh, nope. Watch out. Okay, his dodging looks neat. You fight a big guy, you just go around the side or the back. And you just keep doing that until he's dead. Ooh. Use my axe to do some major damage. Mm -hmm. Dodge around. Dodge. Jump. Jump and... Ooh. Uh, like, like, no doubt, he's death is cool. I'll give him that. You know, he's uh, he's using the two sides backwards, which is very neat. Can I double jump? I had wings come out a second ago. I like that I can do that. Just check my health and my uh, MP, my mana. Um. Ooh. Oh. That was a little sweet detail. I like that. That's kind of cool. I wonder if you can, like, uh... Mm. Got a little bit of a mirror's edge thing here. Alright, so there's the Archangel uh, Michael. Let's see what gift he's got for me. Well, I mean, you know, of course, games like these, if you're a fan of uh, God of War or Castlevania Lords of Shadow, or just any of these, you know, these fast, uh, fast-paced combo games, uh, of course you're gonna enjoy it, you know? They're, 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 they're usually fun. They're usually entertaining. Um, Castlevania 2, Lords, uh, Lords of Shadow 2, um, <laughs> I remember playing that for like an hour and then I just stopped. I like the intro, but when you get to the future and you have to fight the robots, I was like, I'm I'm done. Yep. Okay. So yeah, just regular wall jumping. As always, it's uh it's a given. I just do my thing here and, wee, and then vine, so then I just climb. So very straightforward, very simple. Uh, there's nothing too extreme here. But it is entertaining, you know? It is, uh... It is, uh... Entertaining. I'll give it that.
It does. It, it it does feel good. I'll give it and I'll give it that. It feels really good to play actually. The the controls are very smooth. Um. Oh. That was nice. Bye. No. God damn it. I didn't mean to flash kick. I meant it. It straight up is a flash kick. That is. A guy would be proud. Like I mean. That's it's just. It's just a flash kick. Um, there's no, no block that I can see. I do like this. That's pretty nice. Oh wait, can I? Uh, the side flips are cool. The back flips. The the black. The back flip is actually kind of a. I can't really see like. If it looks like they skipped a few frames of animation just to make it look faster. No, man, give me all that animation. I want to see him flip, yo. But yeah, very straightforward. Um, very fun. I, I do know, like I said, that I didn't play much of the first one. Uh, it just wasn't for me. It still was a very entertaining game. I did play quite a lot of it, but it, I just never really felt too crazy about it, you know? I guess I just jump. Jump, jump, jump. Whoa, oh shit. What the fuck just happened there? Oh, yeah, like a boss. Was that not how I was supposed to do it? Or was that how I was supposed to do it? I don't know. Uh, go to... No, no. Go... Oh, damn it! What the... Let me try that again. So just... Huh. So you can either climb on top or just go across. Uh, I, yeah, I don't know why Death just kind of like leaped off by himself there. There's nothing down that way. Um, I was a very big fan of Castlevania Lords of Shadow. Like, that is one of my all-time favorite games. And that's why I was so disappointed when the, uh, when the second one came out. And I, I couldn't... The intro was really good. Um, they, they do the whole Castlevania Symphony of the Night, uh, conversation, which I thought was great. Who is this? Keeper of secrets, I need your help. I helped you once before, horseman. Look at me now. You look fine. You just look old. to put you out of your misery. Not yet. I know why you've come. Your brother, the one called War. He's been imprisoned by Yeah, the so this is a prequel. And awaits their judgment. For the years, animation for is kind of reminiscent of da the darkness. Why should I care about your which which is a great a great because game. You know that and the second one both really fun. Um <laughs> the council will condemn War. Strip him of power, let him rot in oblivion. Voice acting is very good. My secrets cannot prove his innocence, horsemen. No, but they can help me to erase the crime. Bring mankind back from extinction. That is really cool, though. If it's madness, like, who better to show me the way? Should a way exist? I mean, it's 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 a possible thing where, here. if death has the power to take life, could he give it back? And if the apocalypse was was started uh, quickly or like too soon could he take it back take it back in exchange for its secrets you agreed to keep the amulet no the voices they curse and threaten without end they cry to return you must destroy it I cannot you annihilated their flesh why do you guard their souls open the portal you will not pass while you live. shall not so pass! Alright, come on, Gandalf. Oh, I'm wearing I'm still wearing my armor in the cutscenes, that's neat. Here your brethren are trapped in eternal torment. Do you wish to join them? My brethren. And what of war? 
Would you kill your brother to save your precious balance? He is innocent. Are you so certain? You know, I do have my PS3 set up. Why not? Why not play the first one? Or do, I think I might even have it on my. Uh... That's not war. That he's still chained up by the Chard Council. Okay, you gotta admit that's pretty cool. War and death pacing each other. Oh shit. Get him with the aerial combo? Kind of. I can use it to. Oh shit. Oh! That's. This is, I mean, this is a cool fight. I'll give it that. Yeah, I thought so. So, one of the D pad buttons is a potion. Oh shit. So, which fucking direction am I supposed to dodge? Oh, there we go. Of course, you got the quick time events. I mean, what is a character action game without uh, quick time events? It's a given. Damn, the, the reaction time for a combo or er, dodging is very slow. Although it does seem like I can just pretty much go like directly through him like Whoa! kind of in a sense. I mean one thing though you, you really can't beat death. Uh the the only way to actually kill death would be The only way to actually kill death would be to kill everything else. Um. Oh, cool, getting XP. So there is a level up system. Uh, but yeah, the only way to actually kill death is would be to kill every other thing in existence. Because without any more reason for people to die, he would be he would be completely pointless. Uh, I'm actually getting this off of the Bible where there's a Bible verse that says uh, death would be the last enemy to be destroyed Your secrets die with you Old fool My secrets But not yours Uh oh, did I just fuck something up? Oh, that was easy. But I'm I'm very much enjoying this game. This is a uh, very very entertaining. Um, I, I'm liking this one a lot more than the first one. Oh, oh, shut up, phone. Uh, let's play for just a little bit the more. Uncountable worlds of our universe swirl in an endless abyss. abyss is uh, capitalized. It means it's a location, like Any a real place. Ravaged by time or conflict, are swallowed by the there it is again, Abyss. Returned to the nothingness from which they were formed. But others linger for eternity on the brink of annihilation. That, that creation, that creation might, be might be balanced with destruction. With destruction. And in the final yeah, moment of battle, oh, was banished that's right. Speaking of, um, of tonight, woo, in, in Japan, we are going to be getting uh, Star Wars Episode Eight. Would be found um, at midnight tonight. So the very first minute of December fifteenth will horseman. be. You are wounded. Will be a uh, Star Wars. Your arrival here is a bad omen. Yes. Is that Pan? Troubles me greatly. His hands are fucking huge. Old one, there's more trouble ahead if you don't start making sense. Where is the tree? So I got life? these shards stuck in my chest now. Life. 
<laughs> this world is dying, lad. Choking on chaos and corruption. We can do little to stop it. Jesus Soon, Christ. The great tree too shall perish, and with it, the last of my people. And you are? Is that not what brought you here, Pale Rider? I seek Am I Clint Eastwood? Your chaos and corruption don't concern me. Oh, look, a uh, stone golem. I am liking the uh, the combat meter as well, uh, showing me how much damage I'm doing. That's always you nice. Fight well, but this corruption can't be beaten with a blade. You're huge, Seek dude. Out the forge sister. Ask her about the fire of the mountain. Help her. And Do the rest of the Gorons live there? The tree. As for me, I must return to my work. Yeah. Who are you? Who are you to command a rider? I am a maker, older than even the child. That seems a bit far-fetched there, dude. These hands Huge hands. laid the foundations for many worlds, but that was long ago. And now, they but hardly know the touch of stone. Are you not curious as to why I seek the tree? I would not presume to question one of the four, but yes, tell me. I must restore humanity to redeem war. Heaven and hell battle upon the shattered earth. All creation trembles, and at the center of it all. I wonder if this one would, like, would help me appreciate the first he one a bit innocent. more. I never said he wasn't. The tree holds power over life and death. If you would resurrect humanity, then you are headed in the right direction. Be warned. A dark presence dwells now within the tree. And the path is barred by corruption. Okay. May the makers forge like your Looks like there's a Ah uh, leveled up, baby! Nice. Uh you obtained a skill point by leveling up, which apparently is just an old man uh in a thing. You've leveled up. Every level gains a skill point in which you can purchase new abilities. Press option to enter the character menu and spend your point. Okay, so uh death summons bloodthirsty ghouls from beyond the grave to fight alongside with them. Uh, death teleports across the battlefield and delivers a violent scythe attack. Ooh, let's do that one. Necromancer's nice too, but, uh, I'm all about the healing. Uh, okay. Okay, I only gotta hit it once. Uh, so, ooh. Let's put it to, uh, L1. Nice. Okay. Interesting, interesting. So you're just like there all the time. To be like, Hey bro, you're going the wrong way, bro! Yay. Wrath potion. Uh, I remember these games always did kind of have like a, I don't want to say a Legend of Zelda feel, but it had adventure like it. And invisible walls! Me likey. Some old bushes. Whoa. That was actually interesting. That was like a, like a combo roll. It's interesting. What, can I, uh... Ah, yeah. I can only do it like three times before. What about the backflip? Okay. So I'm trying to see the timing be between uh, how many times I can do before I can do it again. Okay, when he when he has a full stance. Okay, so so far this game is a, a major positive. If you do not have this or have not played this, I would highly recommend it. So far, so far from what I see, what I'm seeing, and what I've been playing, this is very entertaining. Uh, and for the the cost of free. 
Um, I would give it a, I would give it a very positive plus. A very positive, positive, positive. It's very positive. So, so far the only negative, um, out of this entire month is the Kung Fu Panda game, which you can avoid completely. If you want to try it, go ahead, but you're only going to play for like, maybe, maybe not even more than an hour before you... Mm. I was like, did I just fucking teleport? Uh, before uh, before you quit um, I'm not going to do the other game which is uh, until dawn rush of blood only because that is a VR only uh, I don't own a VR myself and not many people do um, I would still say uh, just add it to your library because I know it's great I know it's a lot of fun it is short but it, it's a uh, it's a good um, I guess, I guess I want to say party game, but, okay, so let's pause, um, yeah, Rush of Blood I would highly recommend, this game I would highly recommend, uh, Forma, Forma 8, that's what it's called, Forma 8 is, uh, interesting as well, I would, uh, I'll, I'll give that one a plus, and the only one I would actually uh, recommend to uh, refrain from getting would be uh, it's probably just uh, God. I don't even fucking remember the name. Kung Fu Panda: Legend of Legendary Legendness or something like that. Uh, other than that, this has been what's the plus? Um, Kung Fu Panda, negative. Forma Eight, positive. Rush of Blood, uh, like I said, just because of the gimmick of it, I'd give it a positive if you have a VR. And Darksiders 2 Definitive Edition, i give it a plus. But everybody, thank you guys so much for watching. This has been the first episode of What's the Plus. Uh, I'll do this show once a month to show off what games are worth getting. Uh, other than that, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye! I'm gonna keep playing this. This is a fun game.